many residents, Deborah Lazar and her husband watch BCTV on a regular basis. It's one of my favorite channels because it's fresh, it's intuitive, it's about local politics and local artists and events that are happening locally. Hi Peter, welcome back to town. It's great to be home. I am just so extraordinarily grateful to Wyndham County for electing this little putney boy governor. You did it, and we are gonna do great things for you. Thank you so much. It's BCTV's Nightly News Roundup 545 Live. It is pretty windy out here. We're all here live on Main Street. Back to you, Roland. Back to you, Roland. Back, back, back to you, Roland. During the week, they look like ghost towns. But come Saturday morning, the shanty towns come to life. I auditioned for Oprah. That was our grand prize winner. It is a show. Give me one piece of change and continue on my way, praying that one day I can bring real change. Good morning, BHS and Brattleboro. Yesterday, boys baseball lost. Hey Cooper, how's the weather going to be today? Where is my head today? It was wild! Town without pity. They say Brattleboro can turn a good man bad while he's still in the womb. Good evening! Good evening! Today's top story, we have a clothes problem. These clothes are out of control. I can't believe it's up to me to save the world again. Very efficient. I concur. The film you're about to see is a compilation of clips taken to Northern Ireland. This is a great opportunity to work in the building to connect the kids from Clark Canal with their, with their community. Why were you filming me over there? Oh, I'm working on my project. Each person will get about a second, like a collage. There are many unique places in Brattleboro, Vermont. One of these places is the Insight Photography Project. on the climate. WVEW, Brattleboro's only non-commercial community radio station. So you create a network of people who each offer different services. Ooh, time, time trade. trade! Come on down and shop. We are open. We are open, so come on down. I'm open for the good. We have everything heifer. If you have anything in the world, you can join this campaign. We are your hosts for the 10th Annual Strolling of the Heifers Parade here in Brattleboro. These are the things you never see in the press. It is a very, very tender, very tender moment. This short program will give you an overview of what's happening with each of the local CARES groups in Wyndham County. Welcome to the Vermont State House. Good morning, Mike. Good morning. Somebody, somebody came by here. They said we love to walk by here. It's like walking by the zoo. I was driving along a country road when I came upon a small business. Welcome to the first show of Healthcare Update.
we're lucky to live in Vermont, where communities come together in tragedies to turn tragedies into opportunities. The Federal Police Department, along with the Vermont State Police, are currently investigating the shooting death of a 59-year-old male. Last night, local residents held a vigil for Michael Martin on the Whetstone Brook. This is Brattleboro, Vermont. I'm on Flat Street here, and as you can see behind me here, the street is completely flooded. You have people up to their knees in water here, cars that are completely submerged. Route 9, roughly from Route 91 over to Bennington is closed off. There's flooding everywhere. I want to thank BCTV. They do an outstanding job, and for the staff and all the volunteers, thank you for all you do and provide for not only our community, but the surrounding communities. BCTV does an extraordinary job. It's a real community service.